Okay, we are going to be looking at the automated way to find directory traversal exploits. And so you can go ahead and open up a terminal and have Juice Shop open and running. And just to make sure you have the tool installed, you can come down to your terminal and you can type in sudo apt get install should look exactly like this. And then you will hit enter. It will require your password and you can go ahead and type that in and it will run and it might ask you are you sure you want to install and you can press Y and then hit enter or return if you're on a Mac and it will install and so the way to run this tool is very very simple um, you would just type in dot dot pwn and then we will give it the parameters that we want it to follow so we'll just type in dot dot pwn and then we will go dash m and this is I actually already ran it just to make sure it would run on our local um, server and so this is what you will type in you will type in dot dot pwn and then you'll flag m http and then you'll flag h and it's our local host and so i actually just came up here and copied and pasted the page i was on and when you hit run it will run for us Oh, it did not run for us because we have to run it as sudo, as our super user. And now it is running and it'll ask us, press enter to start the testing, and then we'll go ahead and hit enter. And now you can see, look, it is running all of those for us with a dot, dot, slash, dot, dot, slash, and then it encodes it and it just runs through and it tells us even where it's vulnerable. Now this web application is vulnerable um, I think it's vulnerable to all of them. Uh, they did not do a good job when building the web application for uh, making it secure to this attack. And you can go ahead and hit Command C to close out of it so that it'll stop running. And it might have actually went ahead and solved a challenge for you. Um, if it didn't, you can go ahead and type in uh, dot dot slash dot dot slash dot dot slash really any of these because it says it's vulnerable to them. Um, and then type in etc slash password, and it should pull down, I think I already solved the challenge, um, it should pull down that we have accessed a file that you should not have had access to. And so that will solve that challenge for you. Um, it's pretty simple, running this tool is really easy, and it uh, takes a lot of the manual testing that we just did out of account for us and it will run uh, hundreds of different ways to find a path traversal and that is it for directory traversal it's pretty simple and dot dot pwn makes it way easier for us to run this vulnerability and to scan for it and to fuzz and see just where this is at so 